Hi, my name is Thomas Kim. In this video, I will demonstrate how Google Translation, Google Translation software is correct. Translating Korean into English and English into Korean. Okay, let's try. I prepared a simple text in advance and I will copy and paste to Google Translation and I will translate it into English. Okay, some of you, some of you may not understand the Korean text, so I will explain. Did you take medicine? Okay, it's correct. Did you take the medicine or did you take medicine? No, no means 아니요. Why? 그냥 먹기 싫어서. I just, I just didn't want to eat it. I just didn't want to eat it. Okay, I can accept it. Then. Who wants to take medicine? 약 먹고 싶은 사람이 어디 있어? Yeah, it's correct. Now, let's see. I hate to eat. 싫어도 먹어야지. 싫어도 먹어야지 means even if you don't like it, you still have to take medicine. So this, this sentence is absolutely wrong. Okay. In this sample, you can say Google Translation did very good job. Just one sentence, the last sentence, but the last sentence, all translation is correct. You can say, wow, Google Translation is wonderful. Well, let's see. Big, let's see another. It's very simple, almost the same, but very different. Absolutely different now. I copy now that. 약 먹였어. Did you take medicine? It's wrong. Let's try. It's wrong. 약 먹였어 means did you have him take medicine? It means did you get him to take medicine? So it's absolutely wrong translation. Now let's go. He just does not want to eat it. 그냥 먹기 싫대요. Okay. I can accept it. 약 먹고 싶은 아이가 어디 있어? Where is the child who wants to take medicine? Okay, it's correct. I can say it's correct, very almost correct. If you do, if you do not like it, I will feed you. It's absolutely wrong. It means even if, even if you do, he doesn't like it, it's not you, he or she. Even even if she does not like it, you should still have. He, have made him take medicine. It should be, even if he does not, doesn't like it, you should still have make him take medicine. So this, this, this is also absolutely wrong. This sentence is wrong. This sentence is wrong. So this very short and simple Korean text is translated absolutely wrong. It doesn't make sense. It's absolutely wrong. And this is also absolutely wrong. So let's try. I, I will, I will, I translate it into English. For example, in the, the first case, English by myself, Korean text into English. Now let's try to translate English into Korean. Okay. Say, did you take medicine? 당신이 약을 복용했습니까? 당신이 약을 복용했습니까? Yeah. We, even if we don't say like this way, I can understand it. No. 왜? 난 그냥 기분, 하, 기분, 기분 하지 않았다. It's totally wrong translation. 누가 약을, 약을 복용 좋아해? It's also, 누가 약을 복용 좋아해? Yeah, I can understand, but it's broken Korean anyway. 당신이 그것을 좋아하지 않았는 경우에도 약을 복용해야 합니다. Yes, this is correct translation, but it doesn't, it, it's very strange, very strange translation for Koreans. So this translation is very bad, or act, really, it cannot make any sense to Koreans. It's very like a broken Korean anyway. Now let's let's translate from English into German. Okay. Do you understand? This is pretty much correct German trend. Even if I don't know much about German German, but I can I can know it's correct because I can do reverse translation. 
from German to English now. From German to English. Did you take the medicine? No, why not? I just did not feel like that feel that way. Who likes take medicine? Even if you do not like it, you have to take medicine. Well, I'm not sure it's correct. Yes, it's correct. But now let's try to Fran French. See, sorry. I will copy English text again. Then from English to France. Fr French. It's almost correct. We can do reverse translation. Have you taken medicine? No, why not? I, I did not want. Who likes to take medicine? Even if you don't like it, you still need to take medicine. It's almost correct. Perfectly actually correct, right? And now let's try some other language, like another Indo-European language, such as Spanish. What about Spanish? Spanish. I will copy English text again. Now from English to Spanish. Okay, now reverse translation. Did you take medicine? No. Do not. Why not? I just did not feel like it. Who likes to take medicine? Even if you don't like it, you still have to take medicine. Yes, it's almost perfect. But you should know Korean to English translation or English to Korean translation almost does not work. I will give you another example. See, this is Korean text. Then English... No, no. It is Korean, then English. Did you take medicine? It's wrong sentence, wrong translation. No. He just doesn't want to eat it. It's okay. It's, it, I can understand it. Where is the child who wants to take medicine? It's okay. If you don't like it, you, I will feed you. It's correct. It's absolutely wrong. So English, Korean, in Korean into English translation, machine translation, simply does not work. Even this short and very, how can I, simple, simple text, it cannot be translated into English. Some of, some of you may argue there is like neighbor translation. This is neighbor translation. I will put the same text, okay? the same text. Now let's translate it into English. Did you feed her? Okay. But in this, did you feed her medicine? Medicine is not here. It should be yak means medicine. Okay. Did you feed her medicine? Or did you have her or made her take medicine? That's correct English translation, but it's absolutely wrong or missing in its translation. No, why not? They just don't want to eat. It's very stupid. 그냥 먹기 싫대요. It does not read any context. Where is the kid who wants to take medicine? Okay, I can accept it. Even if you don't like it, it's not you. It's he or she. Even if he or she doesn't like it, you should you should fe still feed him or her the medicine. Or you should have, you should make him or her take medicine. So it's absolutely wrong sentence. Now let's go reverse order from English to Korean translation. Okay, I will copy and paste to neighbor translation. I pasted it and this is Korean translation. 그를 did you get him to take medicine? 그를 약을 복용할 수 있었니? It's totally wrong translation or wrong Korean or very st stupid translation. 아니야? 아, 왜안 되나요? It's okay. 그는 단지 약을 먹고 싶지 않았다. Well, the translation is correct. The meaning is correct, but the structure, the style is absolutely wrong. 그가 어디에 
약 먹는 것을 좋아하는 아이는 어디에 누가 약 먹는 것을 좋아하는 아이는? Well, I think I can understand, but it is not correct Korean at all. Now let's see the next. Even if he did not like it, you should have made him take medicine. 그가 비록 그가 약을 좋아하지 않는다면 여전히 그를 약을 먹는다 했어야 했다. Absolutely broken Korean. Doesn't make sense. So English into Korean also doesn't make doesn't work in neighbor. Now let's try to Google. Yagal Mokke Henny Ani Weande Kuran Tanji Yagal Moko Shipchi Anas neither. Well, Yagal Mungal Chowan and Ain and Odiso. Okay. Kuga Kosal Chowa Haji Antara, the Tangshin and Yajari Yagal Pogong Hage Hesaya Hamnida. It's really hard to say. It doesn't make sense. Let's go back to neighbor. Neighbor says N to NT. 인공신경망 번역. It means artificial nerve system translation. Artificial intelligence or AI is simply some people have took fancy about artificial intelligence but artificial intelligence is nothing more than statistical analysis or statistical estimation, something like that. It's just an algorithm. It's not perfect. And because Korean text, Korean language is based on context, especially spoken Korean conversation is based on context, and Korean is very economic, Translation from English into Korean is almost impossible. Modern Korean, modern, modern software developing tool is based on CF, CFZ, or is called context-free grammar. But human language, especially Korean, is context-sensitive. How can context-free grammar can implement context-sensitive human language. I don't expect, in, I don't think or believe in foreseeable future, in near future, that English into Korean translation or vice versa, Korean into English translation is possible. That's not possible from my belief or from my knowledge or from my experience saying that English into Korean or Korean into English translation, it doesn't work in in foreseeable future. Like I don't think in even five decades from now on, or five decades after, fifty years after from now on, or even hundred years, a century later, maybe it can be possible a century later, but I don't think it is possible within Five, five, within 50 years. Thank you for watching.